Hi there everyone, this is Paige from Traditional Catholic Femininity. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, hello wherever you are. And um, this is just a quick video post um, where I wanted to give you a really good dating tip that will save you wasted time and future heartache. So about a couple of days or so ago, I shared a link on my Facebook page, the Tradcat Femme Facebook page, and I, it was a link about a video with a guy who was giving advice, telling women that basically they should always have their boundaries and standards because it is important. And if you lower your boundaries and standards for a guy, that's kind of a stupid thing to do because. A man would never lower his boundaries or standards for a woman, ever. And he and he is right because um, a man would only date and marry men. Have basically men have the audacity to only choose to date and marry specifically their dream girl. So. Um, let's say their dream girl is a uh, five foot two blonde woman they will they will happily waste the time of any other woman that doesn't fit that that criteria but the moment that five foot two blonde woman comes along they would ditch whoever they're with whether it's their girlfriend or it's their wife and they will go marry and they will go be with their dream woman so basically if you are not his dream girl he would not date you I'll marry you yeah you may use it for sex because a lot of men will happily have sex with women that they don't care about or women they actually <laughs> hate um, but he will marry you and if he does marry because he feels um, well maybe my dream girl isn't coming along because they have in their mind men have in their mind a specific idea is a, a specific picture of the woman that they like that they want so even if he settles for you because you throw yourself at him you chased after him you're doing all those things for him you're giving him money going 50 50 on dates yeah he will use you for the financial and sexual benefits that he can get from you but he will not marry you and if he does marry you in the future, when his dream girl comes along, the girl, the image that he has in his mind, when that comes along, whether it's at work, at a local grocery store, wherever, he would ditch you instantly for that. So here is how you can protect yourself from future heartache because the last thing you want is to invest years and years in dating a guy that he throws you away and goes, goes off and marry marries the next woman in like six months it happens all the time right because you were not his dream girl or he marries you he puts six children into you and then whoops one day he has an affair and throws his whole marriage and the kids away for this woman that he's met that's because the woman he met that is his dream girl so here is how you can uh, protect yourself from this sort of scenario and future heartache and wasted time and by so doing by getting out of these situations as quickly and early as possible you would actually open up the way for you to find a man who is your dream man and who will find you his dream girl so here's my tip in the beginning stages when you're still dating him uh, before six weeks, before six weeks of dating, or if you're in the talking stages, right? Just casually ask him, just ask him this question. So, if you were to have a dinner party and you had a choice of one particular female celebrity figure or public figure at your dinner party in your house, who will that be? Now, don't ask this question in a very serious tone, or you know, don't don't make it sound like um, an inquisition. Just be very playful about it. 
be very playful and flirty about it. Okay, it's for babe. So if you were to have a dinner party at your house and um, you, you had a choice of a particular female celebrity or public figure, who would that be? So just be playful about it in that way and ask him that question and then listen to his response. Now, if you are, say, um, blonde <laughs> and a busty five foot seven woman, but the woman, the celebrity figure that he had idolizes or that he would want at his dinner party is someone who is a latina and she's got dark hair and brown eyes you are not his dream woman sorry but you are not so when he tells you that if the woman that he describes or the aesthetics of the woman that he that he describes is nothing like yours please know that he's trying to use you for something please know that you are not his dream woman he wants to use you and at some point in the future he is going to throw you away and um when he gives you his answer don't show any reaction just say oh, okay that's cool and then over the next few days extricate yourself Click swiftly and quietly from that relationship. Don't tell him. Oh, it's because you mentioned this other celebrity, and I don't look anything like. I don't. Don't tell him any of that. You're just gonna teach him how to lie better. Just accept the truth from his mouth and quietly get out. Start dating other people, right? Um, another way you can find out if you are his dream girl is um. If he has social media, especially things like TikTok, uh, no, sorry, things like um, Instagram, right? Go and look at the profiles, and if he's dumb enough to be follow, following like multiple types of women, if he has social media, especially Instagram, and he's dumb enough to be following multiple women, right? First of all, a guy. Having an Instagram and following so many women is a huge red flag. I wouldn't date a guy like that. But let's say he has you no, know, you decide you want to lower your standards and date a guy like that. Go look at his follow list and look at the types of women he's following. If the majority of them, your ethnicity, your looks, your height, your figure, and you know all of that, doesn't fit. Or correlate to what you look like and your ethnicity you are basically um, a placeholder you are not his dream girl you're a placeholder and you should dump him don't tell him why we don't want to be teaching this man how to lie better don't tell him why you're dumping him just stop it and move on so um so yeah, so I hope this I hope this helps save you um waste of time and future heartache. Um we don't want to be placeholder for men. We want to be his dream girl. And I promise you, no matter what you look like, there is a guy out there, several guys out there in fact, that will find you as you are. Your ethnicity, your weight, your height, your figure, as you are exactly what they're looking for. And you just need to hold out for that. And don't waste your time with men who are secretly using you um, for, for attention, sex, or money and using you as a placeholder. Don't do that to yourself. Okay, so I hope this helped and I hope you have a really good day. And thank you for subscribing to my channel. Bye. Toodles.